Welcome to Let's Check Out Attack of the Killer Tomatoes for the NES. This is Ron Moore, and I have never, I don't think I even watched the cartoon back in the day. I remember the cartoon Attack of the Killer Tomatoes, I've never really watched it. So, yeah. I don't know what to say about the concept, it's pretty weird. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. So, and obviously I never played the game either. So I've only heard of the Killer Tomatoes, but never played the game and watched the cartoon, or I don't know how it originated. Maybe it was originally a comic book. I do not know. But I'm going to go ahead and check out the game for the very first time. I wonder what rating this game got on, on Rotten Tomatoes. But anyway. Okay, so let's look at the storyline here. Doomsday Tomato. <laughs> Alright, we got the Joker now as a villain. Catch Chuck. Tomacho. Nice. Chad Finletter. What the? That sounds worse than... Daryl Cooper Smith from Adventures of Babysitting. What the heck? Is that the moon from Majora's Mask? So, have the killer tomatoes taken over the moon as well? That's weird. But anyway. Alright, so let's get going with this game. Alright, so here we go. What the heck? You got hit already? What? What's that noise? Is that sound me walking? And what is this? Lunch bag? What the heck? So every time I walk, you gotta hear the ch 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 That's kind of annoying, but anyway. Ah, I do like the lighting effect when you're when you walk to the spotlight, then you leave the spotlight, and then you start again. That's pretty cool. A soundtrack okay so far. What the hell was that tomato bat? Whoa, what is that? How you kill that thing? Am I, am I doing any damage to it? Oh, what the heck? Well, forget that. I'm just going to go ahead and move forward. What the heck? I can't go any further. So do I ha So I have to beat that thing? Well, how you beat it? Ah, what the... Okay, that time it ran off or just... Squirmed off, whatever the heck it did. Okay, let's go to the sewers now. Whoa, what the radioactive sewer water here. Now, dang it, I just got through beating a game where I'm in the sewers a lot with Dirty Harry. Now I gotta deal with this sewer stuff again. Ah, alright, well, here we go. Let's see if I can drop down. I guess you can't. I'm gonna get that lunch bag. I, well, fail. That's a failed way of dropping down. Why did I jumped on that ledge? What was that about? That was about me failing. Alright, so let's try this again. There we go. Hmm. Well, I can't... Ah, what? Wait, don't tell me it's game over already. Jeez. I guess it is game over. Okay. Try again, Tomato Face. Oh, you pwned me. Oh, wait. Well, I guess it's not game over. 
from starting the same spot. What? Man, I'm gonna get pwned by a little tomato. Okay, so that's how you stop the sewer slime, whatever it is. Dang it, I thought I jumped on it again. I oh, forget it. Let's go in this room. What the heck are these things? Trojan tomatoes? Okay, I collected something. Don't know what that was. Ah, oh, man, fail. What? I got killed by that little drop of m dirty water, whatever the heck it is. What's with these games and sewer levels? Darkwing Duck had a sewer level, and of course Ninja Turtles, that's different because they live in the sewers. You got Dirty Harry, and then this game now? What the heck? Ah, what? And I think, uh, what was the game called? I forgot for the Genesis Comics, Comic Zone. I think you played in the sewers as well. Oh, nice. Got past that part. What is that, Snake Tomato now? Ah, come on, Ronnie fell. Land on the freaking ground right. I'm getting another chance here. And play as some kid, Chad Finlet, or whatever his name is, he's in his pajamas, I guess, or whatever. And he looks like Zack, the fifth, the fifth turtle for Ninja Turtles. Ah, come on. Man! Whoa. I got hit right there, but I guess I have had a little bit of invincibility while I'm starting the level again. Why is the screen flashing? I need to get a hit right there. Whoa! Nice. Alright. Whoa. These acid drops, seriously, I mean, whoever came up with the concept of killer tomatoes probably was on acid, and, and so am I, apparently, for just jumping into acid, because I didn't know where to go there, is it a dead end, or what the heck, where am I supposed to go? Maybe I'm supposed to go back, let me try this again and make sure I'm not missing anything, let me get this full bag of energy again. Yeah, I'm not seeing a place to go, so I'm going to have to go back. Ah, dang it. Seriously, that walking sound effect is annoying. I mean, it don't even sound like footsteps. I mean, is that really necessary? So snake tomatoes again, whatever the heck they are. Whoa, a little glitch down there. The platform is actually green for a second. Okay, let's go this way. All right. Is that a spider tomato now? We got mutant tomatoes over here. First in Ninja Turtles, you had the mutant pizza monsters. Now you got mutant tomato monsters. Ah, fail. Oh, shoot. The Doomsday Tomato has been launched. Oh... Well, the city's doomed. It's been covered in tomato sauce. Okay, finally I got game over, so let me start over here and give it another chance. Get the bag of energy. Oh, there wasn't a full bag of energy though, but that's alright. Ah, oh, what? Dang, it jumped, it caught, up, it caught up to me. There's the full bag of energy, nice. Watch out for the mini boss here, whatever this is supposed to be. Come here. Ah, dang, it turned around and got me.
I really don't know the full background of Kill Tomatoes. I don't know if it was originally a comic book or I don't think it was a movie. I did hear the cartoon. That was it. Trojan tomato now. Ah, I fell. Right, so we are this part of the game again. Spitting, I guess. Catch up. Dang man, that thing ain't playing around. That's a different. Uh, that's a different tomato than what I was stomping on on the surface earlier. Hit that thing without getting hit. Jeez. What? What the heck? Aw, oh, man. I thought I was avoided getting hit right there. This is a weird game. Just, dang it. Stop jumping on the, the ketchup bullets. Whatever the heck they're supposed to be. Tomato saliva. down here. Uh, that thing again. Man. No. What the? What the heck is that? Carmen San Diego? Yeah, you better run. Man, seriously, those things are hard to stomp on. You like if you just one pixel off, you get hit. Man, I thought I'd get past it one time without getting hit. Ah! Alright, here we go again. Nice! Ah, oh, come on. Man, it's freaking stupid. Now there's Darkwing Duck again. What the heck is that? Whoa. Catch up loogies now. Ah. Uh, geez, geez, these drops get more annoying. Nice. Full energy. All right. Now watch me lose it again real quick. Trying to figure out the pattern here of these drops. Man, come on. Sit. I stomped on those things. Come on. Those things are fast. Watch out. Backtrack now. Ah, oh, man, what? Since when those things start jumping real far all of a sudden? Cheap tomatoes. Whoa! Oh, nice. Surprised I didn't die there my first time that part. Whoa. 
I need to die here. Whoa, those drops aren't touching me. I guess the after it splits, it can't hit you. I don't know. Oh, that's going here. Whoa! Whoa, what is that? Whoa! Okay, well, there's Darkwing Duck or Carmen San Diego, whatever this boss is supposed to be. What the heck am I supposed to do here? What's that picture of? The Doomsday Tomato? Whoa! Okay, now I can throw rocks or whatever the heck I got now. Since I can't hit Darkwing Duck, I guess I just gotta freaking hit each one of these pipes. Each one of these organs, whatever they're called. As I fight the Phantom of the Opera here and the fa uh, Tomato Phantom, I guess, whatever it's supposed to be. This is weird, man. I guess I'm supposed to hit all of them and then the, the that thing crashes or whatever and I win. I don't know. And this, is, this is weird. This thing's a hard to dodge. Shooting tomatoes everywhere while trying to hit each each pipe. Ah, fell. Mm. Almost got it. It's tricky, man. Trying to not get hit. There, tomatoes everywhere. Oh man, one more hit and I'm dead. Time this right. Ah, oh, and I timed it wrong. All right, one more chance here. Man, aim right, stupid kid. No, the other... I'm trying to throw it in the direction of, and it's not. Oh, I got two more to go. Two more. Come on. Throw it toward the right! Jeez. All right, good. One more. One more. Ah, oh, come on. I had it. Dang, we both died right there. Ah, oh, come on. Give me the benefit of a doubt. No, I'm not going to try again because I'm done. I am done. So, there you go. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes for the NES. I don't know what else to say about it except this game is weird. Um, I don't know much of the history of Killer Tomatoes. I guess I got a lot of catching up to do. And so, yeah, um, but as far as this game goes, I guess I'm going to have to give it maybe, I mean, so far, uh, maybe a 6 out of 10. It does seem interesting, weird, but interesting, but uh, definitely challenging so far. Um, and soundtrack, I guess, is okay. could be better. Controls could be better. Game's kind of me mediocre to me right now. But uh, maybe one day if I give him more of a chance, I may actually like it. And now it has me curious to check out the history of Killer Tomatoes and see where it originated from. If it was just a cartoon or if it was a comic book, I don't know. Maybe some of you guys can explain to me in the comments below. Or I could just go do research myself. Um, so, alright guys, that is it. I am out of here. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Ron Moore. God bless and take care.